Ink Paper Doll. Hi loves, it's me, your girl Z, and welcome to my channel. All of my social media will be linked in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, and of course, don't be shy, subscribe. Hit the bell to be notified every time I upload. Hi loves, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new, you know what to do. Go ahead and click the subscribe button below and become part of the family. My name is Z and I love to do tons of lifestyle, beauty, girly, and fragrance related content. So if that's something you guys are interested in, go ahead and hit the bell notification to be notified every time I post a new video. All of my social media will be linked in the description below so you can check me out over there if you like. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this video. Say yay video! 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 Okay. Um, Pinky's being really, really like babyish right now. She wants me to hold her and she wants to stay in my arms. And I think it's because Bunny's out of town and she misses him. And I've been on set and I've been in class this last past like week and a half. Yeah, I think it's Wednesday. What day is it? It's Wednesday. It's definitely Wednesday because yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Wednesday. So um, yeah, I've been on set and in class and doing a lot of self tapes so I haven't been giving her a lot of attention so I think that's why she's a little clingy today. So if you guys see her popping up in and out of frame, just like completely ignore it. <laughs> um, anyways, I just got off set and I thought, girl, why waste the look? Why waste the makeup? If you guys are interested in seeing any of my talent related content, you can go ahead on over to my other talent channel. I'm sorry, looking at Pinky. You guys can head over to my talent channel it's always linked in the description below enough of my rambling let's go ahead and get into the haul so I picked up quite a few things for fall and I've been meaning to actually show you guys this so the first item I picked up is pretty freaking random um, it's not a clothing related item I'm just gonna show you because it's all of the clothes are in this basket so I'm just pulling things out but I got this from Marshall's this is by the kiss brand this is our some Halloween nails now you guys know I love press-ons if you don't know and you're new here now you know I love to wear press-ons I just like being able to change out my nails every single day to match my outfit but I was looking for some pink Halloween nails and of course I could not find any but I thought these were really cute there's like this nude one with a ghost on it that's really nice a spider web you got a jack-o-lantern on there I don't know what this is supposed to be the gray with the white stripes I'm thinking it's supposed to be like a mummy type look these were $5.99 from Marshalls. The next thing I got from Marshalls are these cute pink fuzzy socks. I do have a pair of pink thick fuzzy socks like these. There's a name for them. Yes, they're called Lodge Socks and this is by the Jessica Simpson brand. These were $6.99 at Marshalls. You guys, I do feel like $7 for a pair of socks is kind of like eh, eh, eh. It could have been $5. But I went ahead and picked them up because they were so super cute and fuzzy and they're super thick and they're made with Sherpa inside of it. The only thing I'm going to say about these socks is be careful when you stick it in the washing machine because the last pair I had that I stuck in the washing machine, the Sherpa part got really tangled and messed up and matted and it just was not a good look and it didn't feel comfortable anymore. It was really hard and dry. So just be careful with washing it. I wouldn't put it in the washing machine. But I love these. They're so cute and they're like pink zebra print and they're just Cute. and they'll be nice and warm for the holiday season so you guys the next place that I went to is Q's in the mall I was looking for an outfit that I could wear for fall that I could wear in California so in LA you guys it's still pretty hot I mean we've had a few rainy chilly days but for the most part it's like 80 or above um, I think the other day it went down to 78 degrees and that was the lowest it's been in a while. So a warm fall outfit, if that makes sense, for warm seasons. I don't know what I'm saying, but I found this set at um, Q's Fashion in the mall and it is a three piece. It is a little pink crop top, it's really cute. Um, I do think it's going to be quite big on me, so I am going to have to take it in. Not excited about that. This is in a size small, and I do believe they had these in other colors. I just can't remember what. I want to say they had it in a brown color and a, like, tan color, but I got the pink. Of course, it's a nice and fuzzy material. I do think that you should probably hand wash this. Let me see what it says. I wouldn't put this in a washing machine. 
Hand wash, <laughs> cold, do not bleach, dry flat, iron, do not dry clean. So don't dry clean it, don't machine um, clean it. You have to hand wash this. But that's the top, you guys. Here's the skirt, really cute. You guys can see how that fits on the try-on portion. And then here is the cropped sweater, and I like it. It has those really cute brown big buttons in the center, and just really nice. And it feels warm enough, and it also comes with an extra button. This was 30 bucks, which I was at first like, ugh, 30 bucks? Are y'all kidding me? Because I know this came from China. I know it came from China. But then I was like, well, when I think about it, $10 for the sweater, $10 for the skirt, $10 for the um, shirt, $30, okay, yeah. I guess that's fair, whatever. But yeah, you could probably find something like this on Shein for way cheaper or AliExpress for way cheaper, but I was there, I saw it, I thought it was cute. So now we're gonna move into Ross. First off, I got this shirt. It's like a two-piece top, it was $14.99. It's brown, and I know you guys have been seeing this trending, like this cropped sweater, turtleneck, arm situation. I don't know what you call these, but it looks like a little shrug at the top. And then you have like this sweater tank top at the bottom. The tank top is definitely way too big, but it's okay. And it comes in like this brownish golden color, which I really like. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a mustard golden yellow color, but it also has brown in it. Have you guys ever had mustard and you put brown sugar in it and you stirred it up? that's the color that this looks like. I know that was a weird analogy, but that's exactly the color this is. I love this. Um, the initial thing that caught my eye was just this upper part. I really don't like this, the tank top. And I even tried the tank top on it and it didn't fit and I just thought it wasn't cute. I also don't like that they put it together like it's literally sewn in together. So I'm, I'm gonna cut that because the only reason why I picked up this top is for the top part of it. I like that. And I feel like I can wear that with a bunch of different crop tops and tank tops that I already have and love. So that's why I picked it up. Again, $14.99 at Ross. I was in the market for a pair of black sweatpants. Now, I do have a pair of black sweatpants, but I put them through the wash and it got like those tiny little balls on it. You guys know what I'm talking about? Like sometimes when you wash your clothes and they get like the balls on it and it just doesn't look clean and fresh and new anymore. That's what it started to do and I just, I can't. So I really want to get a nice pair of black sweatpants that I can wear with different tank tops and loungewear. And I found these. These are by the brand Kayoyo, 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 Kayoyo. I don't know. Kayoyo, I think is the brand. That's the brand. Okay. These were at Ross again and they were $8.99, which I thought was a steal. They are thick. Look at how thick this is, you guys. The material. So freaking thick and warm and cozy. They have these pockets on the leg that are actual real pockets. I love a real pocket. I am here for it. And yeah, I thought this was a good deal for a pair of pants of this good quality. And I will show you guys how it looks in the try on, but I figured I could wear that with some sneakers and a cool, again, crop top. I know it is fall, so you guys are probably like, why are you mentioning summer stuff like crop tops? Keep in mind, I live in California, so. Okay, so the next item I got from Ross is actually one of the tops that I might be wearing in a scene. I don't know, but it's this one. It's a velvet, um, chocolatey brown, but it's not really chocolate. It's like a caramely, chocolatey brown color. I don't know. Why am I trying to be so specific? You guys can see in the camera what color it is, as long as my camera is adjusting correctly. Um, and this is in a size small, I believe. No, extra small. It's super cute. I love like the indentions on the side of the top, like that detail, that so detail, because it gives you kind of like a really cool silhouette when you wear the tank top. I love it, it's super thick. And this is by the brand Mixed Threads, Los Angeles, and it was only $7.99. I thought this was super cute. It is kind of a crop. What I will say is that the strap on this is this a strap? What am I saying? A strap or a sleeve? I don't know. Guys, this is a strap or a sleeve. I'm tired. I've been on set all day and I just got back. And I've been rehearsing and classes and self-taping for a week and a half straight. Every single day. All day. So I am exhausted. Is this? What is this? Somebody comment below. I think it's a strap. 
it's really long so it does kind of give you a little bit of cleavage so if you're someone who wants to be like cute and sexy I think that would be really nice with a pair of jeans would be cute and some gym shoes that would be so cute the next item I picked up is this little baby tee and it has a, like this lettuce hem trim at the bottom I absolutely love this I do wish that they would have continued that pattern on the sleeve here but they did not that is okay but it's just super cute and cash and I thought that this would be cute with a pair of sweatpants that I have that is exactly this pink color and they have these little snap buttons down the front I really like the detail with the snap buttons it's so cute and I thought of course this would be really nice with a cute gold necklace maybe some gold hoop earrings and my sweatpants and some white chunky gym shoes and go off this was $6.99 so next you guys this piece when I saw it I was just like yes I have to have it I went in there looking for like sweater vests sweater vests have been trending for a very long time now and I don't think that they're gonna be going away anytime soon so I definitely wanted to pick me up one now I was looking for a pink sweater vest but I did find this and it is this peach colored sweater vest super cute I love this color it is thin enough where I feel like you could wear this in the summer spring and also in the winter you could just pair it with like a turtleneck and in the summer and the spring you could pair it with like a white t-shirt and it would be cute or in the summer you could just wear it as is with some baggy mom jeans and some dad sneakers and rock it but this was by the brand society 22 and it was only $7.99 I am just in love with that peach color I did get this in a size medium a because they did not have any extra smalls and B because I do like to wear my clothes a little bit baggy because I don't really to be honest with you guys I don't feel I have much of a body like I don't have boobs and a butt and stuff like that so it just it, I feel like I might as well just lean into that and go baggy and then that way you don't have to worry about seeing my tiny boobs or my no butt because it's hidden under the baggy clothes maybe that's insecurity I don't know but I just that's that's and I just like being comfortable and I feel like loose clothes are comfortable and I also thought layering this on top of stuff would be good so having it a size or two up isn't a bad idea in my case it's two sizes up um, this was originally $39 you guys see that tag originally $39 and it says the color is pale blush this is not blush this is definitely peach but I'll let you have it okay guys so next on my list is something that I have been obsessed with since I bought it I've been waiting to do this haul so that I can wear this BAM 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 nothing to be said look at her do you guys see this ah! these are embroidered butterfly mom jeans I say what embroidered butterfly mom jeans oh, dead I'm dead I'm dead it's so cute I was just looking for regular mom jeans not only did I find this pair but like if you guys are new here I'm obsessed with butterflies I don't know if I ever told you that but look at the pink butterfly purple butterfly yellow red blue oh my god it's just it's this little pink butterfly by the ankle I'm gonna cry it's too cute these were $21.99 it is by the brand organic blue it's a hundred percent cotton and look at the cute butterfly on the booty oh my god just shut up shut up shut up and it says mindful collection eco-friendly please recycle me on the back that is so cute it says our product is ethically made from recycled or sustainable certified fabrics while preserving our natural resources that is so cool so I feel good about this purchase because I bought something that was really cute that I really love and I feel like I would get a lot of wear out of that is also healthy for our planet so I'm happy Oh, I've been waiting to wear this outfit. I've been waiting to bust out on this. I've been waiting to bust out on y'all with this outfit. Like, I've been waiting for it. This is a two-piece outfit, which I knew I wanted to do. Uh, I wanted to do, like, a sweat two-piece outfit with a 
um, a flannel shirt and some dead sneakers. That was the look that I wanted to do for the gram. And so I was looking and I came across this sweat set. This was $15.99 I think for both pieces. Yeah, the top and the bottom. Here's the top. So cute. It's like a hot chocolate brown crop top and it's made out of sweat material. This is in the size small, if I did not say. I love that it's ruched right there because it's gonna provide a waist for you. And then, for the bottoms, they have the matching pants. And there's a tapered ankle, which I love tapered ankles on sweatpants because it's cute to roll up your sweatpants and have that baggy look. It's just, it's cute to me at least. Um, but yeah, and it also has a string, which is important for me because my waist is super tiny and I always need the string, so. I'm happy about that. And then um, I found a flannel. Um, unfortunately, it wasn't in the color that I wanted to go with that outfit that I just showed you, the sweatsuit. I was looking for something like a orange, pumpkin-y orange and black and white flannel that I could pair with it. But I did find this flannel-like shirt slash jacket. It's a brown, it's so cute. I love browns for the fall. I've been really into browns, pinks, and whites for the fall this year. And I do love this. It is a pretty thick flannel. I would say this is more like a jacket than a shirt. I wouldn't wear this as a shirt. I would definitely wear this as like a layering piece. It's by the brand Mixed Threads and it's an extra small. No, it's not, it's a small. <laughs> and it was $16.99. I thought that was a really good deal. And then on the back, you guys, I'm just gonna hold it up. On the back here, it has like a little, you guys see that little ruching there? It just makes it look ultra feminine. Like I really like the fact that it's masculine, it being a flannel, but then you have that little ruching at the back it just makes it so girly and so cute. And then you have pockets. The pockets are real on the front, but they are buttoned, um, so. You can put stuff in there, but it's super cute. Yeah, I really like this, and I'm sure I'll get tons of wear out of this. Last but not least, you guys, I was looking for a jacket, a cute, like, vintage-y looking jacket. That's what I want. I was just like, if I could just find a cute fall, vintage 90s-ish looking jacket, that would be great. And guess what I found? Look at her. Is she stunting on y'all? Mm, 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 mm. Look at her. I love this like little collar here. I love the zipper, the loop zipper. That is so cute. Again, 90s, 90s. It is so cute. Look at how it's sewn here. All the details in the sewing and the puff sleeve with the ruching there. Oh my goodness. And then the bottom, there's not much to be said about this jacket. All I can do is show you guys it on me and then you'll understand why. But yeah, it's super, super cute. I love it and I thought this looked so cute with like a turtleneck and like some corduroy purple pants, you guys. If you watched my um, thrift video, it was a while ago, like actually a long time ago. I bought, I thrifted some purple corduroy, was it corduroy? No, purple velvet pant and I thought that this with those purple velvet pants and a cute turtleneck and a gold necklace will be so cute and fire. So yeah, got that. And I also thought this might be cute when I go out of town for the holidays. Let's see, what was, how much was this? This is by the brand. There's the brand. There's the brand right there, can you guys see that? I don't know, it's not focusing. But I got it in a size medium because as I told you guys before, I like to layer pieces and there's no sense in wearing anything super tight because I don't have a body to show. Okay, okay. So this was $15.99, you guys like, I think that's like probably even better than a thrift price, $15.99 for this. Love that for me. I didn't see this in the bag, you guys, but I did actually pick these up, so I'm gonna show you. This I got from Ross as well. These were $3.79, and it's just some little, I don't know, I call these telephone cord bracelets, but I'm sure they're not. They're like hair ties, but I'm not gonna use them to tie my hair. I'm actually just gonna use them as bracelets, you know, to style my outfits, because I think that would be cute. So there is a pumpkin orange, there is a mauve purple, and there is a dusty rose pink. And all of the colors look good together, but they also look good subtly. What more could you ask for? 
okay guys that is it that was everything that i picked up for fall i definitely will be picking up more clothes especially as we approach the more cooler months and the more i mean you guys are probably depending on where you are it might be super cold but i definitely will be picking up more clothes and outfits as we approach the cooler months i'm happy to do my christmas shopping and things like that so anyways thank you guys so much for being here thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you got inspired please comment below and let me know which item was your favorite i love you guys and i will see you in the next video oh and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe because it really helps me out and i really appreciate it thank you guys so much i love you and i will see you in the next video bye bye guys